hi guys welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel in today's video i will be sharing my review of this mochi ceramide toner by tony moly but before sharing my review please remember skincare is subjective what works for me might not work for you and and please do a patch test before trying out any products on your skin so without making this intro too long let's jump into the video so it comes in this huge transparent plastic bottle that will last you for a long time i bought it last year and you can see how much product is still left in it coming to the ingredient list i'm just mentioning only the key ingredients otherwise this video will be too long however i will attach a screenshot of the complete ingredients list so you guys can just pause and read it so the key ingredients are ceramide but sadly it's on the bottom of the ingredient list ceramide is the goopy stuff that holds our skin cells together and plays a super important role in having a healthy skin barrier and keeping the skin hydrated sadly this toner only has 5000 ppb ceramide in it apart from ceramide it has glycerin which is a humectant and great for moisturizing our skin it also has macadamia seed oil which is a plant based oil it is loaded with emollient and nourishing fatty acids it is high in oleic acid that makes it ideal for dry skin types macadamia oil has a cushiony feel to it it also easily absorbed and makes the skin soft and supple the next one is centella asiatica or sika which is an amazing antioxidant it is also extremely soothing on the skin it also works as a humectant next one is allantoin which is not only soothing but also works as a skin softening agent and protects our skin it can promote wound healing next one is panthenol or vitamin b5 it helps to moisturize the skin panthenol can help our skin to produce more lipids that are important for a strong and healthy skin barrier It also has sodium hyaluronate or hyaluronic acid that provides lasting hydration to our skin. It also contains some fragrant components such as rosewood oil and lemon seed oil which give it a lemony kind of fragrance that goes away post application. Coming to the texture, it is a milky texture toner that is on the runny side. Coming to my experience I have combination skin which means my T-zone is oily and the rest of my face is normal to dry. It is a lightweight toner that doesn't take much time to get absorbed into the skin and it feels a little bit sticky initially but once it dries up completely it doesn't feel sticky at all. It's easily spreadable and has a nice slip to it. Post application it gives a dewy finish and makeup glides beautifully on it. It makes my skin soft, supple and mochi like bouncy. On the hydration part, I would say it is decently hydrated. The skin friendly ingredients like glycerin, macadamia seed oil, sika, allantoin, panthenol, ceramide and hyaluronic acid helps in soothing and calming my skin. I have been using it for a really long time and it didn't cause any irritation on my skin. I have used it when my skin barrier was compromised and surprisingly it helped to soothe my skin. I use it during night time. It can be used by combination normal or dry skin types. Especially normal and dry skin people would love it. If you have oily skin and live in a hot and humid weather, it would be heavy for your skin. Though your skin might like it during cold winter months. To sum up, the pros are it is affordable as 500 ml retails for 1250 rupees but during the nika sale you get a 40 to 50% discount on it i bought it for around 525 to 550 rupees it does moisturize and hydrates the skin it makes my skin soft and glowy it is great at prepping the skin for makeup though it has a milky texture it feels pretty light on the skin now the cons are it has essential oils like rosewood and lemon So if your skin doesn't like fragrance or essential oils please stay away from this product. The bottle is huge so it is not very travel friendly. Apart from these two cons I didn't find any other cons. Overall it is a decent toner. I wish they would make it fragrance free so that a lot of people can try it. However it suits my skin and I'm enjoying it a lot and I'm definitely going to repurchase it. 
If you like milky texture products and are looking for an affordable toner and don't mind fragrance in your skincare, you can give it a try. I hope you found this review helpful and if you did, please like this video and share it with your friends and subscribe to my channel for more such content. I'll see you guys in my next video. Till then, take care and bye.